Hey guys, welcome back to the vlog. Today I am hopefully going to have a dressage lesson. It's a little bit cold and icy out, so I'm hoping that that doesn't get canceled, but I'll be able to ride in the indoor. So I wanted to do a groom tack and ride with me. Since some of you guys had been wanting an update on what I've been working on in dressage, I have been taking lessons with my coach here and there. So we, I have a lesson today. And actually for the first time in a while, I have someone that can film it for me. So hopefully I'll get some good clips from my lesson. You guys can hear her and see how far Doppler and I have come. So to catch you guys up a little bit on the dressage saddle situation, I did have this saddle that we've decided is not the perfect fit flocked with a half pad. So I have been riding in that just for my lessons. I've been trying to do all my hacking in my jump tack otherwise. Um, I did take it home and work on these flaps. They are much softer now, you can hopefully see. Some of the saddle is still a little bit firm when it comes to the part that touches his sides. So I do want to take it home this weekend and apply some more of that hydrophane leather dressing. But I'm going to put the saddle back together, aka put the stirrups on it so that uh, I can use it today in my lesson. And then I'm going to beamer and stretch and groom Doppler. And then I will actually tack him in the stall with you guys today so that hopefully, put this on the wrong one. Hopefully you guys can see a little bit of what my tacking process looks like. It's hard to film in the stall, especially when he's moving so much, but hopefully we'll get a good idea of that today. Okay, I'm gonna start by getting Doppler out and beamering him. Then I will stretch and groom him before I take him back to the stall to tack him up. <laughs> Please 
don't do that to me, that one's painful. It's been feeling kind of off and on good and bad. You know, winter's, winter's tough for him. Okay, I'm gonna let him finish beamering and then we'll get back to grooming once the beamer's done. Okay, time to tack up. Let's see if I can. So I realized this lesson footage may be a little sporadic, so I apologize if it's hard to follow, but there's just a bunch of snippets from different portions of my lesson. The person that was filming didn't film the whole thing or very long sections, so I apologize if it's a little hard to follow, but hopefully you guys can get an idea of what we are working on. Yes, shoulder back, shoulder hand. Yes, right, right. 
So just to explain to you guys a little bit what we're working on, uh, I've been working on trotting and cantering large circles, coming off the circle at the top of the circle and doing a small 10 meter circle in the opposite direction, then coming back on the circle. We've really been working on bending him, loosening him up, helping with his suppleness and helping him lift and strengthen his back. Um, he always strug struggles with being tight in the neck. That's just 
you know, something he's dealt with probably his whole life. And so we've just been trying to figure out how to really unlock him, feel, let him feel all loose and supported so that he really is, is cantering up through his back and his body and, and trotting as well and using all of those muscles. And we're really just harping on all of that strengthening and those suppleness exercises at this point in time, which has been so helpful for him. He feels really good. Is officially freezing rain and our driveway is a sheet of ice so that was a fun walk back up. My boots have ice layer on them. So um oh. so great lesson today. Um hopefully you can hear my coach Lucy talking in some of the video footage but Doppler's been feeling amazing and he was so good today. I'm actually eager to see what I look like because I have not filmed a lesson in who knows how long. But I'm really pleased with how he's feeling. And I think he's so much more fit and stronger than last year in the winter time. And I've thoroughly been enjoying our dressage together. Um, you know, he's actually such a fun horse to dressage and I feel like he just makes me so much better and it's just really rewarding really fun I'm gonna go untalk him and feed some horses now and fear the cold brain Okay, well everyone's fed and everything's pretty much wrapped up here, so I'm about to head home. But I hope you guys enjoyed the pieces of my lesson that uh, a friend of mine filmed today and uh, where we're at and what we're working on in dressage. I'll try to get another video at some point when I have uh, someone that can, can be there to be a part of my lesson. Because I, I, I want to be able to share that with you guys more. But it doesn't come out very well on the GoPro. I have to come up with another way to film that. So anyways, until next time, thanks for coming back to the vlog. And I hope you guys enjoyed groom tacking and riding with me. See you guys soon.